Okay, so this is just a quick video on how I go about ways of doing these conversions. You can watch videos on YouTube. Um, Davis goes through the mathematics as well. Uh, I just want to explain how I do it personally, my handwriting. One thing to keep in mind is that in your HSC, you will not be able to take in your calculator. So you must be able to do these conversions by hand. So let's take a number like um, 90, 91 decimal, okay? So imagine we want to print that, uh, we want to work that what that is in um, binary. So what I do is I take the numbers uh, 1, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, and 128. I write them out like this up the top here. So this thing here. And then what I do is I grab this number, 91, and I say, is 91 bigger than 128? And I go, no. So I put a zero here. And it goes, 91 bigger than 64? I go, yes. So I put a one here and I subtract 64. Okay, and so we just do normal mathematics. So it's a uh, five and 25 left over. And then we go, is 25 le uh, greater than 32? No. Is it greater than 16? Yes. So we put a 16 here. And we go, is nine greater than eight? We go one, eight, one, zero, zero, one. And so the binary representation of 91D is zero, one, zero, one, one, zero, zero, one. Now you can get that on your calculator and check it. And now the next question is, how do we convert this to hex? So this is binary. How do we convert this to hex? So what we do is we use this table that we have over on the right here. So I've just written the numbers from zero to nine, and then 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And I've replaced the double digit numbers with A, B, C, D, E, F. And this is the characters that we use in writing hexadecimal numbers. We go from zero to nine, and then A, B, C, D, E, F. Um, hexadecimal is, of course, base 16. So what you do is you, first of all, need to get, for my system anyway, I always go to uh, binary first, and then I take the binary, and I take the number that I've worked out, and I write it here. And what it is, then, the answer is the first digit will be just as we calculated it at the beginning, which was uh, 1001. So what we do is we add that up. We get 9 here. So it's the 1 plus the 8. That's 9. So the first digit is a 9. And then we look at this one here, and we go, well, that's a 1, and that's a 4. So that equals uh, 4 plus 1 equals 5. So that is that is 59 in hex. So we can say that 91, I'm not doing very well here, 91 in decimal equals 59 in hex equals 01011001 in binary. And so that's how I do my conversions.